active travel is good for the nation. Walking for 30 minutes or cycling for 20 minutes on most days reduces mortality risk by at least 10%. There are too many people don't feel safe on a bike, and that has to change. We need to make the infrastructure better, and we need to take people with us on that mission. Now, all of us in this chamber back greater investment in active travel, but right now, a number of third sector organisations are worried about their funding. Some organisations have worked for months without funding. That's not good enough if we're to maintain any sort of momentum. Now, one issue I've mentioned before is the lack of resources within councils, and that's hampering progress. Now, some councils don't have the expertise anymore. They may not have the people to run road safety courses. So I've referred um, many times to the government's well-meaning target of reducing car miles by a fifth by 2030. That's a mere seven years away. And so far, the government has said nothing about how this will be achieved. But we do know that the pace uh, of delivery of those impressive active travel targets needs to be stepped up. Now, my amendment does not seek to wipe out the minister's motion. It keeps most of it and merely says the government should set out some of its plans. That's not too much to ask if we all want to improve active travel.